GTA 6 leaks everywhere so it's that time of the year when we're getting a ton of new information coming out about this game and most of it is, is just leaks and rumors but it is still pretty interesting to know that back in december uh dev actually leaked pretty much everything regarding ps5 and whatever he said was absolutely genuine and he also leaked a bunch of stuff regarding gta 6 and now we have testers coming out and we also have this employee right this was a former employee of rockstar games who blasted the upcoming gta 6 project and basically put that in his resume he wants to get a new job it, it seems like and he wanted to say well i worked on gta 6 right and he quickly took that down and i just want to get right into it and in this video i want to talk about every single thing we know so far leaks the confirmed information information coming out from testers when can we see the gta 6 trailer when it's gonna be releasing everything in this video and let's just get right into it as always if you want to be able to do all of that in gta 6 smash that like button but at our number five spot i want to actually go through this statement now this one was said by dan hauser he's a co-founder of the studio and he said that a while ago so i'm not really gonna read the whole quote but i'll probably put it on the screen and when he said that a lot of people thought that we're not gonna be getting gta 6 for a couple of years years time but then we discovered a third party dev from the eu and he posted everything on the pace bin on december 3rd 2018 and he leaked everything regarding the ps5 and we know sony confirmed everything he leaked so he has some legitimacy right and he also leaked the stuff regarding gta 6 and said that it's gonna be coming out in holiday 2020 now we're having a lot more stuff coming out so maybe whatever he was saying was actually true and this statement that tells us that we're not gonna be having gta 6 for multiple years i mean he never said that but we all thought that's what he was trying to say but what he was really trying to say was that gta 6 is not gonna be a modern day gta game because of politics and the world has basically gone soft and it, it's pretty sad to see and uh, i guess that's why we're gonna be seeing gta 6 be maybe in the 90s or 80s but it's definitely gonna be set in the past but at our number four spot i want to show you guys this glass door review glass door review is basically a website where current and former employees can anonymously review companies and their management and this helps like future people who are looking to get a job there so they, they basically have someone telling them hey how it is like to work there and basically somebody said pretty rough hours but fun games for rockstar studios and when you take a look at what he said under the advice to management well it is pretty clear that uh he was trying to say gta 6 los santos y city and liberty city is gonna be the three main cities of this game and if we take a step back and we take a look at what dev uh, from eu said back on december 3rd 2018 he clearly mentioned that it's gonna have two big cities miami and new york so all of these leaks are being you know pretty hand to hand and this idea is not really far-fetched if you really think about it gta san andreas has Las ventures which was uh, las vegas it also has los santos which which is Los Angeles, San Fierro, which was San Francisco, right? So GTA having more than one city has been actually tested before and it actually worked really well for GTA San Andreas. And we're also hearing uh, number three, we're hearing that this game is gonna be a next gen game. And once again, this Pacebin user says that it's gonna be coming out in holiday 2020 and it's gonna be for the PS5 and next gen Xbox. And Sony is looking to secure one month time exclusive thing and knowing sony's track record they got paper they are making benjamins and they are printing all of that on an hourly basis so it is very likely that they are gonna be able to do that and it's gonna be like the launch title of the ps5 and obviously this isn't far-fetched right back in 2010 we had the first rdr game and three years later we had gta 5 originally gta 5 was meant to come out a little bit before 2013 but rockstar always likes to delay their games and if this time rockstar doesn't delay the game it's gonna be coming out holiday 2020 at our number two spot this leak is coming from an alleged play tester and all of these leaks are pretty consistent because he also claims that it's gonna be liberty city and Y city and he also gave us a little bit of the story detailed and i quote you will start as a small time guy in liberty city doing odd chores and small time thefts and eventually work your way to Y city the end goal is for you to become the i cannot say this word on youtube and this is basically the bread and butter of gta games rockstar games always likes to capture that and they likes to always improve 
and put some twists and turns in the mix and make sure the setting is kind of good as well to spice things up and this time it looks like that this is gonna be the biggest gta game of all time at our number one spot when can we expect its trailer it's pretty hard to predict because i'm not a nostradamus but according to leaks once again its expected announcement is going to be between q3 of 2019 and q2 of 2020 if i had to really take a guess it's either gonna be on sony ps5 reveal which is definitely gonna happen right after e3 it's either gonna be then or it's gonna be a little bit after that but let me know your thoughts in the comments below like and subscribe for more check out some other videos on the screen and i will see you in the next one